Great to be honest, I've really enjoyed my uh, short but good time here. It's been a tough pre-season, but we're starting to see the gains now and it's starting to ramp up for the first league game against Exeter. Um, highs is a tough one when you're doing pre-season, but luckily um, I was involved in the Sing Sevens a couple of weeks ago, so winning that was obviously the high. Um, real chance to see where we got to physically, um, especially with our fitness, so that was great. And the lows, every day is pretty low pre-season, it's about graft, it's about getting through it, and, and, and yeah, it's not, there's not a huge amount of fun involved in there. There's not, obviously it's a, it's a, it's a big squad um, with some famous faces, so I knew some boys, played against some boys, but no, I had uh, no friends here before I came. Um, I've made two now, so it's alright. <laughs> I think it's obvious any player that's given the opportunity to sign it, such a, such a great club and such an ambitious club would bite the hand off. And, and you see from the squad, it's really exciting. The style that Dai wants to play and, and the other coaches are putting in place is great. My overall impression has just been everything is world class from top to bottom. I've been, I've been, yeah, I've been really, really impressed by everybody and everything. So world class. We're speaking really highly of it. The facilities themselves um, are fantastic. The, the, the temporary accommodation as such next to Broad Street is fantastic. The gym is kitted up by Matrix, which is world class equipment. Um, and obviously the people at Broad Street and the surrounding regions have been incredibly welcoming and you know, we're, really, we're really all enjoying it. Uh, there's a few, uh, luckily to be in the changing room with a few. Uh, yeah, Guy Thompson, Alex Reader, Haskell when he turns up is chatty, but obviously he's a busy man, busy man. <laughs> um, yeah, there's a lot of chatty guys, a lot of friendly faces, so no, it's great. Nothing. No, unfortunately, um, put on my time in here. Um, once, once I'm done here, I'll, I'll try and come up with something else interesting. <laughs> Growing up, you know, uh, rugby was big in, big in my life, and at that time it was uh, the likes of big, big Gav, Gav Hastings, Scott Hastings, kind of standard for my age, we coming through, um, with Gregor Town, there's Alan Tate, and since then, you know, I've, I've been, I've known them all personally. I've been coached, I've played with them, like I played with. Uh, Gregor Townsend is my first professional year, so I've been very lucky in that transition to, to be able to play with some of, some of my sporting heroes. The Sing Sevens, they were really noisy, really got behind us and it definitely made an effort, especially in those last closing minutes against Exeter when we were holding on for dear life. I think, you know, the cheer may have blown Reader just that little bit to push the guy into touch. Um, no, so they seem great and um, I'm not sure if they travel or if they're from the local area, but the people in the local area are fantastic. They, they recognise us, say hello, they wish us well. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a really great environment, really great place and I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing it, hopefully being involved in that first game and seeing the, them all fill this stadium. Sing Sevens winning, you know, it's fantastic, we'll, we'll go with that. <laughs>